One thing we know, Jaws, about Bill Belichick, he is going to make sure your best player will not beat you. And if that's the case, we're looking at Julio Jones, the most dynamic threat, perhaps, that the Atlanta Falcons have. How do you expect them to deal with the threat of number 11? Trey, I call that the bullseye approach. Bill Belichick, Matt Patricia, the defensive coordinator, will select one player from the Falcons they want to take out of the game. And I agree with you, it will be Julio Jones. But Julio Jones has faced a bullseye all season long. And Kyle Shanahan has been terrific in designing plays with formation variation, with shifts, with motions, a number of ways to get Julio Jones open against blitz, single high, and split safety. Here's Julio Jones with a tight split, part of a two-man bunch with Mohamed Sanu. The advantage of this formation versus man coverage is it tends to get the corners backed off. This was two-man coverage with safety Eric Berry playing over the top. The pre-snap bunch and the post-snap stack accomplished two things. It gave Jones an unimpeded vertical release. And it got the matchup corner inside. The Chiefs still had two defenders to play Jones. With the threat of a two-way go on the safety and his speed coming out of his break, Julio ran away from both. That was trail man coverage with the fine safety help over the top. Here, it's single high safety with the slot corner playing press man on Jones. The approach here was to be physical with Julio and disrupt both the timing and the route. Jones presents a challenge for the Patriots in both their single high and two deep man coverage concepts. A stiff arm at the 15, 10, 5, touchdown Atlanta. How they defend him will have a lot to do with how Atlanta goes about throwing the football in Super Bowl 51.